well, um, I'm Francisco Flores. Um, I'm going to talk about losing a valuable possession, um, which is considered one kind of thought lock, right? So, well, um, I think, yeah, yeah, so losing a valuable possession is a bit uh, hard at the beginning, but the real thing, that's material things you can get, you can get them again, right? Well, uh, so my experience I want to share with you, it's um, when I was about 14 years old, uh, my house was uh, was rough, and yeah, well, so I lost like many things, like my TV. Um, I have a clash of guns. Well, obviously, play um, toy guns, um, many other things, right? Um, I lost like about a thousand dollars in thing in stuff, right? But yeah, so at the beginning it was like a bit hard to just try to to, um, to process this kind of information, you know. So I was keyed, and it was hard to lose things but at the very end like now if you analyze it um so you can see it's not that bad at the end right uh so i think like uh those kind of possessions you can you can work and get them again so yeah uh, you could consider like kind of talk luck but yeah at the beginning you figure it out like yeah so it happens so it's nothing like about uh, personally don't really like believe and bad luck but yeah so um I think um, this kind of things just happen, right? And you have to get the rubber and go on with your life. So, yep, yeah, so technically, uh, that's, if, uh, that's the thing that I want to share with you about um, losing like valuable possessions, um, which is considered like bad luck. Okay, goodbye.